Well, welcome to another YouTube video of the furnace build. Um, this morning I finished securing the body of the furnace onto the base. Um, just did a bit of welding to keep the what is quite now a heavy lamp on its wheels as it's moved around um, from its storage to uh, where it will be used. Um, that is what will be the cantilever, uh, sorry for the bad light. Um, that whole post and all the smaller bars on it that support the top of the furnace will lift um, and swing to the side so access can be made inside the furnace. Um, you can see there that the yoke will fit on that flat platform and by having a bar through the hole the yoke will lift the lid and then lower the lid um, when necessary. Um, it looks as though it's going to be quite secure, hopefully it will. Uh, that is just a tile keeping the inside of the furnace dry should it rain. Um, but I'm ready just to put some ceramic wool in the gap between the lid and the top of the furnace to keep it airtight whilst it's on. Um, put some brackets on the side to help with the weight. I didn't really think it'd be this heavy, but it's actually heavier than I thought. That's the Tyree leading into the furnace. Um, hopefully in the next few videos uh, we'll be able to fire it up, actually get it going and perform a mount.